welcome to the Red Pen of Destiny channel tour. Um, so we're going to go over what I do and um, my featured channels as well. Give you a little best of of YouTube there. Um, so mostly right now I do the Thousand One Songs You Must Hear Before You Die. I've been doing very short um, reviews of all the songs. Um, probably not the best quality, but hey, if you want to do better, um, you're more than welcome to take over. <laughs> um, also reviewing some special request songs if you want to send those to me. Um, and I have previously done a lot of gaming content and some like TV show reviews. Uh, this is music reviews. Um, Odyssey of Horsepower kind of reviewed a few cars there, only two. Um, might do more in the future, but yeah, that's as far as I got so far. Uh, oh, and uh, 50 States of Mo, one song from every state. That's an interesting playlist. Uh, yeah, that about sums up my channel. Uh, 1001 songs, video games, Occasionally, I'll do some film or TV reviews. Um, but on to the feature channels. Uh, we start with my other channel, uh, L2H High Pointing Evolved. Haven't updated that in a while, but uh, there might be some more content coming next year. Uh, basic idea of that is I go from the lowest point in a place to the highest point. Um, I did that in four videos, it looks like. Um, mostly local to me in uh, central Texas here. Uh, and then we have the Lore Runner. Who Hi there. I'm the lore runner. You may know me. Has an intro video. Um, he is a Twitch streamer and a YouTuber. Um, he basically delves into the lore of um, video games. And I think the best way to start with him is to find uh, one of his lore runs of a series you're interested in. I you know he's done um, Elder Scrolls. He's done uh, World of Warcraft. That's a monster. Uh, run. It's like a 150 videos or something. Each are like hours long. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I, I think that's the best way to start with him. It, is He goes through all of the lore, and even a game that you've never played before, but you're interested in the game, I, he's a really good way to experience the story um, and understand without actually playing the game. Um, and he also does uh, his ruminations, which are basically... I don't want to say the reviews. They're, they're very in-depth reviews, I think is the best way to say that. Um, and he's done a lot of Star Trek. He's gone through most of the old shows, or at least started going through them, because he's right now doing um, the original series and uh, Star Trek Enterprise. So that's an interesting way to watch um, Star Trek. And we also have uh, Two Player Start, who are doing the 1001 games you must play before you die. Uh, they've done 93, so they're, they're chugging along. But I think they're actually trying to beat every game. Um, there's someone else on this list who's not. but It's a very impressive task, and they are very entertaining. It's two brothers, and they have some pretty good banter. Uh, then we have Extremities, which is a spinoff from the Wendover Productions Half as Interesting family of channels. Uh, they sort of do the history of very... Um, remote places. Um, for example, they did uh, the westernmost town in Alaska. Um, they did uh, the smallest British territory, which I'm forgetting the name of, where like 90 people live there, like in the middle of the ocean. Um, so yeah, that's a very interesting series. And it used to be a podcast, so look up the podcast as well. Um, then we have Rooftops of America. Um where he's uh, climbing every tallest point in each American state. And um, I think he's planning on doing the territories as well when he gets to those. But he's actually really interesting. He does like a history of the the area where each high point is. And um, yeah, it's pretty interesting. And then we have another high pointer, uh, Garrett Shaw, who's also doing the highest point. I think he's just doing the states though. Um, and he's also planning on doing the Seven Summits, the highest point on every continent. So uh, he's very interesting to watch as well. And it's kind of have, interesting to have two different perspectives, and they have very different styles, so I think it's worth watching both of them. Uh, then we have Gaming J, the other 1001 video games you must play before you die um, YouTuber. And he's only like doing like a... He does about 40 minutes for each game, sometimes much longer. Um, I know recently I watched a two and a half hour video of a Legend of Zelda game. Um, but yeah, he's pretty interesting, and he's most likely going to finish it because he's well past 600 games so far. 
which is quite an undertaking. Uh, then we have our, our trio of speedrunners here. Uh, Nixo is a Harry Potter speedrun. He speedruns all the Harry Potter games. Um, recently did the complete series run, which is like a 34-hour run where you play like... How many games is it? Like, It's a lot of games. Because um, each movie has been adapted like a couple times. So, oof, it's an undertaking. Uh, then we have Outrageous Josh, a Jack and Daxter speedrunner. Uh, mostly the first game, but he does run all the other ones. And he's, when I record this, working on doing a full series of Jack speedrun, which should be interesting when it gets done. Uh, then we have Dark Viper AU, who's a big uh, GTA V speedrunner. He does all sorts of GTA V content. Ooh, excuse me. Uh, then we have Geography Now, who are doing basically a geography spotlight on every country uh, in alphabetical order. They made it to uh, Syria as when I record this. Um, and they're very interesting. Um, gives you a nice brief look into each um, country in the world. Uh, and then we have That Is Interesting, who is doing a similar project, but with American states. He's um, slowly doing a sort of history, in-depth look at each state. Um, Interestingly, he's doing it in the order they were admitted into the Union, which is an interesting order, and um, it's definitely worth a watch. Um, but that, that sums up my feature channels. I um, hope you'll check some of those out, and uh, check out some of my content.